Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. If you've ever found yourself needing to create a smooth navigation experience between different pages in your Figma file, whether you're presenting a prototype, sharing your designs with a client, or just keeping things organized, you're in the right place. In today's quick tutorial, I'll walk you through exactly how to link text on one page directly to another page in Figma. By the end of this video, you'll know how to make your Figma projects more interactive and user-friendly, saving you and your collaborators a lot of time. All right, let's dive in. Imagine you've got a design file with multiple pages. Maybe you're working on a website and you have a home page, an about page, and a few others. Now let's say you want a piece of text, like a navigation item or a button, to act as a link to page 2. Here, how you do it. First off, we need to grab the link for the page you want to jump to. Over on the left side of your Figma window, you'll see the Pages panel. This is usually where you switch between different pages in your file. If you don't see it, make sure it's expanded. You might just need to click the little arrow to open it up. Once you're there, find page 2 or whatever page you're aiming to link to. Instead of left-clicking like you normally would, go ahead and right-click on page 2. From the menu that pops up, click on Copy Link to Page. And that's it, you've now copied a direct link to that specific page in your Figma file. This little trick works a bit like bookmarking a specific chapter in a book, so you or anyone else can jump straight there without hunting around. Next, we want to connect that page link to a piece of text in your design. Find the text you want to use as a link. Maybe you've got to go to page 2 label somewhere on your canvas, perhaps up in your navigation bar or at the bottom as a quick link. Click to select that text layer. Now look in the right-hand toolbar just above where you adjust fonts and colors. You'll see a little chain link icon. This represents the option to add a hyperlink to your text. Click that icon and a small field will pop up inviting you to paste the link you just copied. Go ahead and use Ctrl plus V or Command plus V on Mac to paste it in and then hit enter. Now here where the magic happens. With that link in place, your text isn't just decorative anymore, it's interactive. Try it out. Click on your link text while holding down the Command key on Mac or Control key on Windows. You'll notice your cursor turns into a little pointer. Give it a click and you'll hop straight over to page 2. It's just like clicking a link on a real website. This might take a few moments the first time, especially if you're double-checking which page you're linking to, but once you get the hang of it, it's super fast. And don't worry if you make a mistake, just right-click the text and repeat the process to update or remove the link. So there you have it. In just a few simple steps, you've made your Figma file smarter and easier to navigate. This is a fantastic way to organize your projects, make your presentations more dynamic, or just impress your teammates. If you found this tutorial helpful, don't forget to hit that like button and let me know in the comments what other Figma tips you're curious about. And if you haven't already, subscribe for more practical design walkthroughs just like this. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.